Energy vibration Nathan for the Scorpion which is said moon and rising sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back you Scorpion this year is going to be a powerful year for you Scorpion it's going to be the year that you're going to change your ways or you are going to be um, you know set back for a very long time I'm seeing wonderful energies um, that is coming up because you have and you're working with the, the water energy you are a water energy this year is the element of water so let's see basically what is going to be coming out for um, you scorpions because what is transpiring in this year is that we have the energy of the high princess we have the energy of judgment and then we have the energy of the wheel of fortune what it is are you going to be using you have three choices in this year are you going to listen to your intuition are you going to be the person to make the judgment what is going to be happening so let's see what exactly is transpiring we have for you the eye princess coming up in January now the eye princess is your spirit guides is your intuition is your guidance is your um, um, uh, ascendance masters it is the goddess and the goddess godliness it is your um, you name it your deities and this is going to be good because they are going to be guiding you on the right part they are going to be guiding you on the right part so this is good so let's see what is coming up oh my god you have your own energy vibration in February which is the energy of the moon so a lot of you Pisces is going to be speaking up um, scorpions is going to be speaking up um, you're gonna be speaking up you're gonna be understanding um, the eye princess and the moon is coming up it's gonna be a very psychic year the first two months January and February you have to listen to your own guide and your own psychic energies this is what you have to do is to listen to your own guides and your own psychic energies okay in the month of March you have a situation to deal with an organization okay group of people situation that needs to be resolved this is why the eye princess is it's as if she comes in in January to um, awaken you to remember who you are okay she came in in January to awaken you to remind you of who you are there is going to be some um, um, judgment calls some breakthroughs judgment calls breakthroughs is going to be coming in so be aware of this there is going to be really some judgment calls and breakthrough that is going to be coming in so you have to be um, aware and aligned with the energies because whether or not you want these energies to be coming in they are going to be coming in for you and you have to deal with whatever the situation is so it's not as if you are going to be you know walking away from this situation again oh my gosh oh yes again this is wonderful because um you scorpions are going to be ending a situation you're going to be overcoming a situation you're going to be ending a situation and overcoming the situation so whatever the situation that is transpiring for the first three months because you have the energy of the eye princess and the energy of the moon which is your own energy vibration in the month of February but then you have to deal with the organization in the month of March. What organization is that? What is coming in? We that's what we are going to be looking at. But um, some judgment call is going to be coming out um, for you, um, Pisces, in January. You, you know you're going to be have to take a good look at yourself. Whatever is transpiring, you have to really take a good look at yourself because whatever that you have done in 2018, January is saying to you, take a good look at yourself. Why have you done what you have done? This is what the eye princess is coming in. Is your spirit guys that is saying to you, Hey, you have done something, but why was the reason look within and ask yourself, what is the reason why I did what I did? 
okay because you did you basically did something that affect a lot of people and affect someone who has done you no wrong someone who only um, means good to you and whatever the situation is whatever that has transpired you are realizing that you know I really need to take a good look at this what have I done I shouldn't have done this it's as if your inner guidance is saying oh my god this is what I've done is wrong some of you um, cannot be affected some of you were affected by something um, of the unseen okay something of the unseen is saying that what has transpired is that something from the unseen world has affected some of you and it's as if whatever that thing was is now um, gone and then you are realizing oh my god what have I done oh my god um, how could I who, how could I have done this so um, you know the person who you have done it to is a family member for some of you and some of you it's a friend this friend is a past family mem member of a past life and um, you're realizing it's as if now it hits you because something is about to go down in the month of March and it hits you oh my god I oh, have I done all of this it's as if um, you're regaining consciousness of who you are it's basically regaining consciousness because you have the eye princess because your intuition starts to talk to you and said hey what did you do you're in some big problems now why did you let your ego push you so far because this is really hitting you like a brick now because your ego has pushed you too far you have done things that now you're in some serious problem now this is the month of January and this is all coming in now in the month of February um, you're going to be trying to make to make things better the month of February you're going to be trying to make things better and how you're going to be doing that is that you are going to be regaining consciousness and trying to go back to the person to say hey I've made a big mistake I've really made a big mistake I shouldn't have done all of what I've done this isn't fair um, you know you know judge me but don't judge me so hard and the person is going to basically say to you you know love is unconditional I guess you know love is love is unconditional and especially a family member for the family member they are going to be just saying you know something whatever has happened is has happened let's just um, turn that page of the book and move forward because that's basically what they're you know what is going to be transpiring and what is going to be happening so you know life is full of surprises and we need to understand this life is full of surprises it is about you aligning with who you are but some of you um, something out out of the norm um, and this is when for some of you you were affected by others were affecting you um, um, with energies and this is why you did what you do okay we you know it is a sense that it has happened so where are you what is going to be happening how are you going to be dealing with this you have this um, as your conscience and this is let your conscience be your guide and you know guys I love you so much and um, because my son is also a scorpion and I love you scorpion so much and I know how you guys are and sometimes you know you do things out of uh, you know being in pain and want someone else to feel the pain um, but it's really going to be a judgment call that is coming in your 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 intuition and your spirit guide is going to say shit look at what I've done I shouldn't have done that you were in 2018 it was like you were driven by your ego the ego was driving you you were so driven by the ego that you weren't seen clearly you were so driven by the ego that you weren't seen clearly and the because the, the, there's twice the eye princess and the moon is coming up the eye princess is saying to you oh my god how could you have done such a thing this is what the eye princess is saying oh my god how could you have done such a thing why have you done this 
was it really needed because you could have um, you know do something different so um, you know this is this is something that is um, really really um, going to be so profoundly um, affecting a lot of you it's going to be really affecting a lot of you so whatever that is going to be transpiring for you guys because um but we're dealing um secrets um this could be secrets coming out um the eye princess could be awakening you as to what you have done the eye princess could be saying hey what has happened to you why you have gone that route you could have done things differently this is what I princess is basically saying it is you know let your intuition be a guide and she's guiding you but she's 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 showing you something um, that's something that you didn't want to see and just I princess is coming back also in the month of September so you're having the moon and I princess that is going to be hitting you as a brick the moon and the eye princess together is your intuitions your guides are going to be coming down on you it's as if whatever that was blocking you in 2008 they weren't able to connect with you because no guides is going to be making someone use their egos the guides are going to be saying you need to release your ego whatever you have done in 2018 is from an ego base and now you're looking for um, forgiveness from the person who, the people and the the persons that you have done this though but are you going to be receiving this and you are having to deal in with it at, for yourself because you are messed up now because you realize oh my god I've done this to this person this person never really um, 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 deal with it you're gonna be um, moving away from this you're gonna be moving away from this things are gonna be good but for the reason that you did it some of you just did it for money some of you did it um, because you have some hunger within you and the hunger that you have was not supposed to be towards that person because that person had never done you anything then love you and give you um, open up their arms to you okay so love was enough you wanted money so you um, make your bed so you gotta lay in it and um, it's hard because um, in the month of March you have to deal with an organization now what is going to be coming out is going to be in the extended reading so love you guys love you Pisces and some uh, uh, scorpion sorry and sometimes I come down hard on you guys because sometimes you let your your ego push you too far and this is what happened now um thank you guys so much for the support likes and share please thumbs up like share these videos um you know it is a year where it is a year of healing for you guys um you guys are looking for to make sure that certain situations um, become balanced um you know there is you're sorry about certain things that you have done um and sorry is the hardest thing for some people um are you sorry or you know you're just seeing what you have done anyway we're going to be looking at this in um, the extended reading please um, cross watch cross watch for your friends cross watch for yourself your boss cross watch for your work to see what is going to be transpiring this is um, a new year for you um, um, scorpion and it's all about you um, finding the right balance finding yourself again and finding out why you do the things you do and why you make the decisions and all that sort of a thing you're basically finding yourself in this year of 2019 okay the year reading is about to come out so um, check out the year reading um, you will see how your year is going to be going because the first quarter is that um, you're moving away um, from a negative situation um, you, you could have created this negative situation or this negative situation was created to get you involved okay and you're moving away from these people and situation now in the month of uh, um, March there is balance that is coming in via the energies of the Taurus or a group of people who are going to be 
helping you to bring balance and uh, helping you um, to give also healing now happy new year I'll speak to you guys and we're going to go further with on demand welcome to all the people on the mound let's see what's happening I don't like this for my scorpions let's see what's happening in January 2019 for the scorpions